and I want this. Next you heard job. that? You heard Next that? job, Jamie. But look at you. Wait, hold on. Before we get into this whole AMA situation, the other day I'm watching TV and I went home to visit my parents and I'm like, True Lies came on. Oh, it's awesome. You know what part it was. It was amazing. You in the bed and swinging around. It was amazing. I never talked to you, obviously, about that. Right. This is our first time talking. Yeah. She doesn't know that, but it's I know. How did you prepare for that role? I know you probably already talked about it. Same thing she did. We, I didn't eat for like two weeks. No, seriously. <laughs> I found out, I got the job, and I, I called the production manager, and I said, <clears throat> how soon are we doing the uh, hotel room? And he said, the first week. And I was like, okay. <laughs> Just spinach and Stop uh, water. Stop eating for a couple yeah. weeks. Yeah. But did you know how to dance? Does dance Jamie Lee Curtis know how to move it? I can move it. Okay. I can move it. I actually picked the song. Jim Cameron said, what song would you like? I said a John Hyatt song, Alone in the Dark. And, uh, you know, what can I say? And it's gone down in history. No, let me say this. I raised a dancer. My daughter, oh, okay. Annie, is a dancer. So yeah. I can move go. it. She can move it to Knives Out, too, because everybody's talking about it. Did you oh, think God. when you signed on to this and you're a part of it that, like, okay, here we go, it's happening again? No. <laughs> you know, you just are excited that the movie's really good. You go off to Boston, you make the movie, and now it's coming out and everybody loves it. It's super funny. It's at a time of year we need a laugh. It's a really yeah. funny movie. I mean, the script was excellent. Yeah. The people were kind of great. You know, I said yes because Daniel Craig was going to be in the movie. I mean, honestly, I would have read the menu um, if they asked me to. Soup du jour. Really. Bonjour, monsieur. I would have said that to be in the movie with him because he's so talented. He's so great. Um, let's talk Halloween. Wow. I, mean, I came here to talk music. <laughs> I've like been boning oh, yeah. up on my music. I'm at the AMAs. We're going to get there, but we have to talk about you for a second. How do we know what's coming up next? And honestly, um, the thrill that we get to see with you to come back again, like what does that mean? And just Well, we have two more to do, yeah. um, at least. So all I can tell you is I made that movie when I was 19 years old. I'm 61 years old. And looking like she's 19. Oh, but I mean, I'm serious. No, like, you, that's no, crazy. Like, that's crazy. To be able to have those moments where you can say, I started this when I was this age and I'm here now, regardless of the numbers, it feels good, right? It all feels good. I'm privileged to have the job I do. I get to do it. I get to have a great time. I get to come here and go to the AMAs, okay. wearing feathers. She wants to talk music. Okay. Jamie Lee Curtis. Who is your favorite artist that you will fangirl out? There's Billie Eilish. There's, um, I think, Christina Aguilera is performing tonight. Lizzo. Who are you most looking forward to? Joni Mitchell. But she's not performing. <laughs> but we love Joni Mitchell. But Carol King is going to, I think, present an award. Okay, Carol King. Carol King. Carol King. Do we know any Lizzo lyrics? No, but I like her. Can we, can we do a lyric together if I teach it to you? No, I have to go. They're Wait, I'm 100% that bitch. I'm 100% that bitch. 